There's something else. I overheard a conversation. Well, I don't know if I trust Dorlin. Dorlin's a two-faced ass, if you ask me. Well, there's certainly no love loss between you two. Here, lay down on this table. I want to take an x-ray of your chest. Let's find out if you have the same abnormality. Ethan, this is important. Get on the table. Get the fuck out of this thing! Rosa? You still there?
Rosa? Mr. Thomas, right? I'm Agent Pennington, head of security. Are you okay? Are you hurt? I'm fine. What the hell's going on? We gotta get you out of here. We're evacuating the building. We'll see if you can open it from your side. The magnetic locks didn't release when the power went out. Mr. Thomas, are you sure you're all right? Leave me alone! Who the hell are you talking to? He's already dead. You're not real! You're wasting time. Mr. Thomas, who the fuck are you talking to?
be right here! You're drinking. My drinking is not an issue. Right. Look, I'll go get this processed. In the meantime, Farrell wants to see you in his office for a mission debriefing. Keep your cool. Corner office, fifth floor.
the grand opening ceremonies of the Museum of Natural History. We have the full support of the city's best, our own local police, as well as the support from the SCU. And we will open to show the city that life does go on. These were the words from the Mayor Rachel Mars as she headed to a meeting with the museum director. With the opening only days away, increasing pressure on the Mayor has many wondering if she truly intends to divert law enforcement resources away from the inner city to protect such an event. It appears that she will. Sarah Brenton, City News. Come in, sit down, Mr. Thomas. Can I get you anything? Yeah. Five aspirins and a shot of soda water. I don't think we... Forget it. Mr. Thomas, please sit so we can get started. Okay, let's begin. I'll be asking you questions regarding the recovery mission of Malcolm Van Horn. Please answer them to the best of your ability. Are you ready to begin? As ready as I'll ever be. All right. What happened immediately after leaving the hotel? We carried Van Horn's body away from the hotel. Was LaRue with the group at the time? Yes. What happened next? Dorland shot a power transformer, creating a small explosion. And that's when you were separated from the team, jeopardizing the success of the mission? Jesus, that was not my fault! Grill Dorland or LaRue about what happened. Mr. Thomas, you should know that Special Agent Dorland is missing. We picked up Agent LaRue a few blocks from the hotel. He and Dorland got separated soon after the victim was extracted. I need you to help us fill in the blanks. Let's continue. Where were you when the helicopter arrived? I was in an apartment complex next door. Explain what happened once Van Horn was secured. The helicopter started taking fire. Who ordered the pilot to leave the team behind? Dorland. Now, this next question is very important, Mr. Thomas. Why did the team split up? Look, let's stop holding hands like a couple of fucking girls. I know, all right? You didn't want me to come back. Dorland made that perfectly clear. Mr. Thomas, please. You gave Dorland the order to leave me behind. An unfortunate casualty in the line of duty or some bullshit. Did LaRue tell you that? So you're not denying it then? <sighs> Wires got crossed. There was a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding? I almost got killed! Sit down. Fuck you! I'm ordering you to sit down. Jesus Christ! Just shoot me and get it over with! Why did you bring me back? You knew, Van Horn, what to look for. He was just another stiff. Why the risky mission? It was important. We control the situation. Cooperation, Mr. Thomas. That's all I wanted. Cooperation? Then what, kill me? No. You've got it wrong. You're lying. Why the order to leave me behind? That order did not come from me! My orders were to keep you safe! I swear it! Uh, excuse me, Director? Sir, I've got Agent Dorland on the phone. He says it's important. <sighs> yeah, put him through. Is everything okay in there? Yeah, yeah. Just do it. This is Dorland. Agent, where the hell have you been? Mayor Rachel Mars has been murdered. What? Where? She was found. Well, most of her. 
was found in the new museum downtown. she was visiting the museum director to discuss delays regarding the grand opening. Media? Expect a maelstrom any minute. Someone knows. First Van Horn, and now... Keep your voice down. Agent Thomas? Mr. Thomas. I found this on the body. Take a look around. Dolan and I are heading back to the agency. Remember our discussion. I'm trying to protect you. Get this to Agent Rosa, SCU ASAP. I'll have it delivered right away. It should be splattered all over the place. Whoa. Looks like the perp used the wheelbarrow to transport the body. Just the actual crime scene and possibly the head are somewhere in the museum. Unfortunately, we're under strict orders not to enter the museum. That'd mean dick to me. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think it would. Follow me. Here, let me give you a lift. The team is beefed up security. Avoid the guards if possible. If you need to take them down, don't use a weapon. I'll take that under advisement.
this is Rosa. I just received that little present you sent me. It's a bit disturbing to think that SKX is still alive. Last time I saw that psycho, half his face lined the inside of a trunk. Well, the body was never recovered, so I guess the chance he survived was always there. Mr. Thomas, the coroner just arrived. He's examining the body now. I'll keep you posted if anything turns up. Every night, assholes break in. found dead inside the City Museum of Natural History. Body has severe lacerations about the back, chest, and arms, resulting in excessive hemorrhaging. There's also an extensive tearing of muscle and ligament within the same region. Head decapitated just above the collarbone. Whereabouts is still unknown. All right, and now for the note you sent me. Found on the victim's body was a piece of paper with strangely drawn eyes on one side, and on the other, the acronym of a serial killer known as Serial Killer X. Both written with a black felt tip pen. Did you find any fingerprints on the paper? Yes. I ran it through IAFIS, and guess whose name popped up? Leland Van Horn. I don't need to tell you this, but let's make it official. Leland Van Horn, AKA Serial Killer X, or just SKX, was allegedly responsible for nine serial murders in the greater metro area. He's the nephew to Malcolm Van Horn, and was thought to be dead, killed by a gunshot to the face. His body was never recovered. You think he faked his injury? According to your report, it seems unlikely, but stranger things have happened. I have a theory. SKX gets one in the grill. His own flesh and blood, Malcolm Van Horn, nurses him back to health. SKX turns on his uncle and kills him. For perhaps the same reason he murders Rachel Mars. Keep searching the museum. We need more information. Saw. Looks medieval in origin. Get a shot of the handle, will you? Got it. Excellent. Look at that. A fingerprint. Give me a moment. Okay, over 50% of the fingerprint found on the handle is compromised by smudging. However, after running the print through IAFIS, I'm able to get a positive match on our suspect, SKX. I'd say SKX is very much alive and is now the prime suspect in the murder of Rachel Mars. What about the saw? You said it looked medieval. Yeah, I hear the museum will feature one of the largest medieval exhibits in the country. Ethan, find the exhibit that tool came from. 
SKX was certainly there at one point. was installed a week ago and just completed its 48-hour stress test. Ethan, if you think SKX may be on camera, find the surveillance room and let's take a look. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, I'm in the surveillance room. Find the backup drive, and let's see if our favorite madman has made a cameo. Okay, the feed is coming in now. City News. With her head reportedly missing, Mayor Rachel Mars is dead. Her decapitated body was found earlier today at the Museum of Natural History. Apparently she was murdered suffering extensive cutting about her body. There are no leads as of yet, but the federal and local authorities have cordoned off the area in an attempt to locate the perpetrators of this heinous crime. More after this. <laughs> 